Pancratia Hall has been restored to its 1920s grandeur, and now it's 100% affordable apartments that have kitchens and bathrooms and quartz countertops and stainless steel appliances. Every wire in the building is replaced. All the heating is new. It's a new building and a historic shell. It was started by a lovely woman who the building is named after, Mother Pancratia Bonfis. She and the sisters of Loretto came out here in the 1880s picked this site at the top of the hill in southwest Denver for its prominence. It became a women's accredited college, and in 1929 they funded uh, Pancratia Hall, a classroom and dormitory building. In the 1970s, Pancratia Hall, Loretto Heights, the entire campus became a co-ed facility. And then in the 1990s, it was transitioned to a secular university, and finally in 2017 it closed. And that brings us to the redevelopment story where we are today. Adaptive reuse is where you take a building that had one purpose, in this case, a classroom and dormitory building, and turn it into an entirely new space. We delivered on the vision. We listened a lot to the city. What they wanted was large apartments for families. Credit to Jim and Susan and Harmonini Investments. They said, we'll take that challenge on and redesign the floor plan layouts and created a project that now has 50% of the units as two, three, and four bedroom units, which is unheard of and what that does is it enables a lot of families to live here. The thing that's interesting and unique about the property is the fact that really no two units are the same. We had wonderful spaces to start from. We had an old chapel. We had a gymnasium that we divided into two really large family units. We had an old ballroom with ballroom arches. All of those historic features we've integrated into the new apartments. I was really excited to be able to get a unit that really had a lot of history. I'm in a very unique space that used to be um, chemistry lab. Lots of different community players and investment, governmental and private, have made Pancratia possible. Pancratia Hall utilizes the Low Income Housing Tax Credit Program along with federal historic tax credits and state historic tax credits. It was really the leadership team of a cast of thousands, literally a cast of thousands of people for five years uh, that helped this project become reality. I've always been interested in historical things. An opportunity to move into something like this was certainly considered opportune to me. It's just unique, I enjoy it. We hope that they love it, and we hope they stay here a long time, and they call it home. Pancratia will continue to be affordable housing for generations to come. Here's another layer of history preserved to tell the story of women's education, layered onto that the preservation of the building as a use that the community and society can be proud of long-term.